Well, Tropical Storm Nicole rolling in here in November, and for farmers, farmers, the timing could mean losses to their harvest. Bureau Chief Dow Kennedy shows us how it could bring a bad end to what has so far been a good year. Cotton farmers I spoke to say this could be one of their best crops in years, but the part that remains out in the field could certainly see some damage depending on what Nicole decides to do. The bands of wind and rain started midday, stirring cotton plants still in the fields. Colby Deal says they picked three-fourths of their crop so far, but roughly 150 acres remain, and this storm has him concerned. It takes a pretty good toll on it. Uh, you know, it'll either lay the whole stalk over or you'll see a bunch of cotton that's blowing off on the ground. He says this storm comes late in the fall and late in the cotton season, too. We've got it all sprayed and it's all open, so there's really nothing to protect it from this weather. He says the fiber can withstand a little rain, but will take sunshine to dry it again before they can harvest. Wind can separate it from the bowl, and a combination of the two can be costly. You, know, you can start losing 100 pounds an acre according to the wind and the rain. He says they'll be disappointed to have such a good crop all season, only to lose the last part of it at the very end. They say the sooner this storm comes and goes, the better they like it. In Bullock County, Dow Kennedy, WTOC News.